Hey, what's happening guys? It's Greg. Uh, I'm going to do a brief introduction of my 2010 X Mark wall behind with my uh, brand new accelerator bagger. Uh, well, it's not brand new, it's been used. Uh, one of you guys said message me and would like a little more detail on the bagger, which is no problem. I love doing this kind of stuff and uh, hope you enjoy. Okay, as I said, this is my uh, 2010 X Smart Walt Behind with the ECS controls. Uh, basically, how this works is just like the pistol grip uh, mower from previous years, but instead, it's the new design with your handlebars up on top. Uh, and uh, from this type of angle, basically, your your safety when you let go it cuts off just like a push mower um, and your arms and wrists are a lot more comfortable with this type of system uh, the pistol grip way is really hard on your wrists uh, especially if you hit bumps and all that jazz so basically how the ECS controls work is once you put the mower on and put the blades on um, you put it in gear and your transmission down here with your knees or your hands or your feet or your legs or whatever floats your boat uh, and then uh, start working it so uh, just like a Z mower you know left arm goes left right arm goes right uh, for example when the mower is on then you come over here you put your hand there and then you just you know go like that the harder you squeeze the harder you turn and so with the right side the harder you squeeze the more it will turn so if you're going to do this on a trailer or pickup truck uh, I would definitely recommend when you squeeze this handle use your thumb and put it in park what that does it that it will lock it in place and uh, she ain't going nowhere so um, that's how that works so if you use the walk behinds with the pistol grip type of handles it's the same design it's just basic right on buddy uh, it's the same design that's my neighbor sorry about that uh, it's just a lot little bit easier to use and a lot better on your wrist other than that it's an awesome awesome machine it's a little dirty. I was raining the other day, so I was trying to get the yards done and got it a little dirty today. So, uh, this is the Accelerator Bagger. Uh, just got it a couple months ago. Accelerator Industries. Uh, Acceleratorindustries.com. Um, I got it at one of my local lawn, uh, lawn care shops here uh, where I live. And I'll tell you what. It's the best bagger I've ever bought. In. Let me tell you. Let me t let me tell you this. The original X Smart bagger, you have to get all these attachments uh, to bolt on the mower. Then you can attach the bagger. Well, thank goodness for this company here. They made a custom bagger just for the metros. Now this company, what they do is they custom make their baggers for all mowing equipment. Whether you had John Deere, Toro, Exmark, Aaron's, uh, you name it. You know, just give them a call, say, hey, do y'all make a bagger for this unit? And take it from there. So, uh, if you wonder what this clip is here, it's for more attachments that they have available for this bagger. Other than that, this bagger here is amazing. Um, basically, when you're bagging and you fall full, you'll take this clip off. Then you pull this up. And then uh, this comes off. The door comes off. You can throw it on the side. And what am? Nice big back door. Um, I use 55-gallon drum liner bags that I get at BJ's Wholesale Club uh, and they work great. 
uh, three of these. We'll fill the bag up and bada bing, bada boom, no problem. So I'm gonna show you how this works, uh, how it goes on the mower. Very, very cool and very, very easy. Believe that. Okay, so what I do here is I come to the mower. Uh, I keep the chute open. I remove the bungee cord. Uh, then the chute comes down. This model here, I got the plastic shield. So it's uh, kind of easy to use. Um, then I pull this pin right here. Take this off. Then I toss this to the side here. Uh, I put that on my trailer or on the back seat of my car or truck or whatever. Now, this is the cool part. This mower, this mower, the way the way X Mark makes this mower is they have this bracket here. Um, then that's basically it. Now the old units, the other bagger companies, you have to use this part with the bolt-ons. Well, thank God for um, accelerator. They basically built it to use it as is. So see this lip right here? So what they did was they put on this piece of angle iron hook that can go in that channel with that bar right there. So basically, that's it. Those two things are holding the bagger in place. So now, I'll come around here and uh, basically grab the handle, pick her up, and doing this one-handed, and now put it right in there. See how that worked out? And then, boom, and you're done. That is it. Just like that. I'll tell you what, guys. The best bagger I've ever bought in my life. Now, it was a little pricey. Here where I live, the bagger was about $425. But I'll tell you what, it is worth it. And it looks good. It's kind of fancy. So uh, that's basically how that works, guys. Um, to my buddy who messaged me, I hope this works out great, this video here for you. And uh, any other questions, just let me know and I could, I could try to help you out. But the, uh, here is the other angle of the clip of how it's through here already built really easy bada bing bada boom hook right there and you're done so happy mowing hope this video is worth it i hope it works um any other like, like i said dude any other question just give me a holler uh, i have no problems hook, helping you guys out um like i said i love I love this unit. It works really well for me. Uh, not too big, not too small. Uh, I also have the jungle wheel attachment. Um, helps me to cut more grass uh, and not have to walk so much. So, hope this video is working. And please comment on my videos. And uh, you guys have a wonderful day. And hope uh, to hear from you soon. Alright guys, thank you very much. Have a wonderful day.